They're taking a pure electric signal and sculpting it into something of beauty. I wanted to have some type of space designed for creating, I guess. I knew that I was going to have basically a, a backdrop, a table, a chair, of course. Just something that I can, you know, have for basically estrogen release. You know, editing and all that fun stuff. Here it is. It doesn't look like much yet. I still got to add so much more stuff to the wall. Um, however, I'm calling this my studio. This is my dining room. I don't really eat at a table too much, so I didn't see the point for a dining room. And I don't have a family. Like, I don't have a husband or kids or anything, so it's not like not having a dining room is going to affect me too much. But anyway, I guess I can show you guys the process of doing this. Me being me, I have to organize, first and foremost. I need to see everything before it goes on a wall. I didn't want to, this is kind of willy-nilly in it. I wanted to be as organized as I possibly could, so I put everything on the floor first before I put it up on the wall. started making measurements not like specific like with a ruler or anything but just kind of like marking it up on the wall on where everything was going to go so um, I wanted to like see it visually with lines and um, also I wanted to make sure that they had the proper space between each um, frame but yeah that's basically the frames of where everything is going to go next i had to prep the frames which was probably the most frustrating actually not the prepping of the frames but command strips don't get command strips don't get command strips they are literally garbage like i've never had issues with my command strips in the past. well i did but it wasn't this bad it was so bad that things were starting to fall off the wall. They were breaking my frames and I was like, Slim, I don't have time for this. So what I did was eventually get a hammer and nails and kind of nailed everything to the wall. The command strips really disappointed me this round. So don't do command strips. But here's me putting the command strips on the frames. slight readjustment um, to where everything was going it some parts look kind of awkward so I kind of or didn't look as exact as I want them to look like they weren't you know I was trying to get a very collage type essence to it and so if it looked kind of too spaced out or too much on top of each other I had to do some you know minor changes but it wasn't too bad um, everything worked out for the most part
know you can't really see it from this angle, but here's my backdrop. Um, I'm probably going to film most of my sit downs and chit chats here um, because this is where my window is, my patio window, well, my patio door is. However, this lighting situation is really busting my balls because I was thinking that I can have it here. I don't know what I was thinking. I should have known that that wasn't going to work out, but I want this in the background. That's why I did it. So I'm going to figure that out. Um, however, like I said, this is going to be my studio. This is going to be my studio. Um, so a lot of filming is going to go down in this space. However, I got to figure out what I'm going to do about this lighting and just like the basic logistics of it. Um, however, with that being said, I'm definitely going to add more stuff to the wall, like I said earlier, and kind of start really investing into my videography when it comes to my channel. Um, I when I say my equipment is like literally bootleg like I'm not even trying to play myself but I need a tripod I need better lighting all that so I'm gonna have to kind of like really focus on saving and like getting my stuff together because I want to do good quality videos you know what's the point go hard or go home right but um yeah so sorry for this like very mysterious shadow I kind of like how it's making my afro look but um it's because the sun is coming. I'm not even going to get into all that, but it's just, it's bootleg right now. So I'm going to have to figure out, <laughs> let's chat. Um, I'm going to have to figure out what I'm going to do. I say all that to say that um, I'm still, I guess I can end this video. I, oh my gosh. I guess I can end this video off. Oh my gosh. I guess I can end this video off by saying that I'm very, very excited for this space and what's to come. Um, this space is probably one of my favorite spaces in this apartment because it's literally, you know, just a happy space like I have so many memories on this wall with my family my friends and like I said it's more to come and I don't know being able to come into your home and see this wall just filled with such positive vibes it's really uplifting so um, I recommend if you have this space make it yours do what you do and you know yeah so with that being said, I'm going to end this video off here. Thank you for watching. If you're watching, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll catch you on the next video.